The Tennessee Secondary School Athletic Association Girls Soccer State Championships made its way back to the scenic city. We are in the first round of games right now. Um, we're in the quarterfinals, so we'll have quarterfinals today at our three venues, which is where we are right now, Chattanooga Christian School, the Baylor School, and the Girls Preparatory School. The Girls Soccer Championships have been held in Chattanooga for more than four years. Cassidy Brinkley with Chattanooga Tourism believes hosting this event is great for the city's economic growth. There's a lot of pride for our community having these events right here in our own backyard, but then there's also the economic impact um, involved in bringing these teams and their families from across the state to Chattanooga for this event. So this event uh, alone has about a $1.7 million economic impact, and so that is obviously why it would be high on our target list for bringing the event to town. Throughout Chattanooga, more than 2,000 female athletes will compete in the soccer championships. Eric Presler, athletic director at CCS, considers it an honor to welcome various high schools to their facility. It's just an honor and privilege to be able to host other schools and offer that opportunity for them to come from all corners of the state and partner with TWSAA and Chattanooga Sports to put on this event and hopefully create a great experience for these schools and these student athletes to, to visit the Chattanooga area and uh, play in a, in, a, in a great setup that gives them an opportunity to, to compete for a state championship. Presler says it's important to not only serve community members, but the state of Tennessee. We just feel like it's part of our role as a school uh, to be able to serve the community and, you know, being able to serve more than just the city of Chattanooga and the entire state and have these schools come in and experience uh, this, great, this great city and what it all has to offer um, is, is a great opportunity for us. And so we're just happy to be able to serve that process. Reporting in Chattanooga, I'm Caleb Figures, News 12.